Okay, and we are back to Zoom Beanies. I believe this is episode six. Uh, let's go ahead and get started. We'll load our old game. Okay, so uh, we have already made two complete journeys all the way from Zumbini Isle down here to Zumbiniville up here. Uh, we have 32 at Zumbiniville, which is two groups worth of Zumbinis. Uh, so now we're about to start another journey. Uh, and my goal for this video is to actually go from Zubini Isle to Zubiniville all in one video uh, and possibly under an hour. So that's uh, three legs of the journey. I'll be taking the southern route because uh, I want to alternate and we'll see how quickly we can get to Zubiniville. And I believe this will be the last time of doing the first and third. Uh, last leg of the journey on the easy difficulty. If I remember correctly, uh, after this, they will advance to the oh so hard difficulty. Okay, so just like before, I want to completely randomize my set of zoominis. So here they come. Okay, that looks like a good batch. So off we go. After days I'll be skipping the narration to try and get through this a little faster. Okay, so allergic cliffs, this can go by pretty quickly. Uh, so he'll go up here. Let's try one with nothing in common down here. Okay, so because they had nothing in common, uh, he's not allergic to either of them. He requires uh, certain features. Uh, let's try sending some Zubinis on the upper path who are similar to the ones that were already... Oop. Okay, so this one is the same as the first one, except he has a blue nose. So I'm guessing the bottom bridge requires blue noses. And it looks like that is the case. And this one's hiding behind a tree. He's purple nose. But I want to be careful. You got them all through. Good for you. I don't want to hit the arrow button until I hear the narrator, uh, just in case. I don't want anyone to get left behind. Here they go. And I can click through that. These stones. And click through this. We've heard these before. Uh -huh. Strange looking bunch. You've seen two groups of Zumbidis by now, so you should be used to it. Um, and then I want to test uh, the upper and lower paths uh, to see... Uh, if it's always the lower path, or if it's sometimes the upper path, looks like it's not the upper path this time. Uh, this guy's pretty different. Enjoy yourself. Okay, let's try him. So these are all pretty different. So um, this guy must require something and this guy is allergic to that something. Let's try. So this guy either he requires blue noses or he requires glasses. Uh, so he requires glasses. It'd be kind of weird if it was uh, blue noses again. <laughs> And that's all the glasses. So we just have to send these through. And that's it. You got them all through. Good for you. Glad you dropped in. And so are Please. 
<sighs> Whatever you are, make me a pizza. Okay, let's try olives. More toppings. All right, olives and peppers. <sighs> More toppings. All right, olives, peppers, Make pepperoni. Come on, more stuff. Wow, he wants a lot of toppings Make this time. <laughs> the perfect pizza. Yay! And I can't actually move until. Oh, there. You don't have to watch him eat. You can just leave. Okay. Well done. You're adjusting to the trials of the journey. Rest up if you must. Push on if you dare. The Zumbinis still have much in store for them. You can't actually click through while he's talking on the screen. But anyway, we're going south to the deep dark forest. There's no and here's the fleems. So let's see, uh, there's, even before we guess, we can do a bit of calculations. So uh, I believe uh, it's always uh, hair to hair, eyes to eyes, nose to nose, feet to feet on the easiest difficulty. So is there any hair uh, where we only have two of them? Well, there should be two pairs of two. Uh, so it's not these guys uh, or these or these. Okay, so it might be ponytails or it might be this little tuft of hair. So one of those corresponds to the bandana and the other corresponds to Vikings. And then let's see. Uh, and then whichever one is the bandana will have a type of eyes that only one other Zumbini has. So it can't be the glasses one. So it's got to be the sunglasses one. What? Did I do that wrong? It was a sunglasses one, just a different sunglasses one. Okay, so it was this one. All right. Well, now we know that feet are tank treads, so we're just looking for Zumini with feet. Uh, and then has same nose color as this, so a purple nose. This one. <coughs> then the last one is completely different uh, from all of these that are already here. It has sort of a rare foot type. It could be one of these propeller guys maybe. Uh, both of these are totally different. Okay. That's it for fleens. Hip, hip. We'll just interrupt the narrator. And keep going. Hurry. Hello. You could just grab yourselves a room. Okay. So. Let's try this guy. The first one is always accepted. Uh, let's try one that's uh, similar in a couple ways. Okay, so either hair or feet is the way things are being ordered. I don't have any more feet of that type. Okay, so it's by hair. All right, so now that we know that, the rest, there's no guessing involved. We just have to put them all in separate rooms by their hair. So yeah, this puzzle, it only takes like two guesses 
to figure it out. Um, as long as you pick the zoominis uh, that you're testing with carefully. Mud ball wall might take a little while. Because that game is basically entirely testing. Hey, there they are. Just look at the time. Got a split. Okay, first one, it has to be a complete guess. But at least we got some. So let's stick with that shape. Okay, let's try the color instead. Now we know where all the shapes are. So let's finish with the ones we know. We need a blue star. Then the rest, we just have to figure out the colors. Try a green diamond. Okay, that was lucky. Let's try the triangle in a different color. Okay, wrong color. That one's red. And then we need a purple circle. Oh, wait, I missed this one. How did I miss that? Uh, so that's a square, a green square. Okay, we're already here. And before he does this whole spiel with the maniacal laugh, uh, let's just keep going. Throughout the All right, this one, there's no logic involved. You just have to look at the wall. I think it's been my nose color every time so far. Wonder why. Oh. That's okay, that doesn't hurt them. There must be a big trampoline at the bottom. I see, I don't have any orange noses. Now the red ones. This one is just a lot of clicking and placing here. Uh, the mirror machine is going to be the one that takes the longest. Because that's 16 individual Zuminis. Uh. Hip, hip, Zumbini! Hip, hip, Zumbini! So this is just looking closely and finding matches. So uh, I'm gonna arrange these guys by something, uh, maybe by feet. We'll see if that makes it a little easier uh, to help find the pictures. Let's do by feet, and then by nose, maybe. 
Actually, let's do it by eyes. Eyes are a little harder to see, I think. So we've got sleepy eyes, open eyes, open eyes, eyeglasses. Uh, then for feet, we've got sleepy eyes, purple before blue. And then sunglasses, we'll have to say over here, I guess. Uh, then propeller, there's no sleepy eyes or wide eyes. There's a single cyclops. Roller skates, you've got wide eyes and glasses. Wait, there's only four shells? Yeah, I thought this was a shelf, but you can't actually put them down there. Oh well. Whatever, it's, it doesn't really matter. I'll leave just wasting time. Okay, uh, no, 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 I don't have that many red noses in my group. I think I have this one. Okay, I know I have this one. This one. They don't have any orange noses, so there's no point even looking at them. Oh, this guy. My odd one out. <laughs> okay, I've got this one. This one. This one. Oh, I broke it. I'm still trying to find that shortcut key that lets you speed it up, uh, but I haven't been able to. Let's see. So we've got a couple springs. This guy. Okay, here we go. Almost done. You're almost to Zumbiniville. This is a puzzle of endurance. Okay, 
this one starting to get faster now because there's not as many. Use the crystal filters to change the Zumbini's cool. reflection. It will give them crystal slamming protection. Use the crystal filters to change the Zumbini's reflection. Interesting. It will give them crystal slamming protection. So I was randomly pressing keys and I pressed F1 and then the narrator repeated his message from when we were entering the area. I'm sure if I read the manual, which I do have, I have a PDF version of the manual, uh, maybe it would have told you about that uh, keyboard shortcut. So maybe I should actually look at the manual and see if there's any, like, skip animation shortcuts. Okay, this one? And... Okay, and then just a couple left. This one... Um, this one. And there's one left. You got them. Sir. Okay. So let's see, uh, hats, looks like hats go along this path, so let's send all the hats through. next one it's going to alternate between the two hairstyles so let's uh, wait until these guys get through I don't want to bump them into each other uh, so it's first going to be the shaggy hair then the flat top okay so shaggy hair flat top shaggy hair Flat top. Shaggy hair. Flat top. And shaggy hair. And then the rest I can just do in whatever order. probably the fastest I will ever complete Bubble Wonder Abyss because after this it's going to get harder and take longer. I want to wait till everyone's across and their feet are on the ground before I hit that arrow button. How fortunate for Zumbinis that you are their guide. Alright, let's go. <laughs> place they've been seeking? A place of hope and prosperity? Zubiniville! Okay, and here we are! And everyone is at Zubiniville, safe and sound. Uh, we don't have any new buildings this time, but that is okay because I believe that next time we do a complete route, we will end up with two new buildings uh, for completing the first and last path on the new difficulty levels. Uh, the middle path, uh, because there's two of them, unless you always do the same middle path, uh, that one will not advance uh, in difficulty at the same rate as the other two. Uh, routes. 
Um, so we won't see the highest difficulty for that one uh, for a little while. But anyway, here's everyone all being happy and cheerful. Um, I think I have, let's see, I could do math, right? 48 Zumbinis here at the moment, which is not a huge quantity. Just a little, a few, a few little Zumbinis here and there. I wonder where the rest of them are when they're not outside. I guess they're in their houses or in these buildings. Uh, but it, the little buildings in the background too, uh, I believe more of those get added uh, the more Zumbinis you have. So right now we have one, two, three, four, five. So I think we have five small buildings as well. Well, what are you waiting for? Free the Zumbinis, you bold adventurer, you. Can't you hear them crying to you from Zumbini Isle? Free them, free them. Yes, yes, okay. All right, let's go back to the map. Oh, yep. Then you can see the first path is yellow and so is the last path. So they advanced uh, after going through them three times. And again, I believe you need to make it through uh, with a complete set of Zuminis without losing any for it to count uh, as one of the times. And then the middle path uh, will be not so easy for a little while longer, both of them. Uh, okay. Well, thank you very much for watching. Um, I will probably do another video soon uh, showing off the uh, harder difficulty levels uh, of these puzzles because I believe they get more interesting the harder they get. Uh, but until next time, thank you for watching.